Well, good morning. We woke up to snow this morning. Not too bad, but. Enough to definitely cover the ground. Wow. So, wow, it's so beautiful. Hope you're having an amazing Saturday. So we are going to try to get out in this weather and do a little Christmas shopping because we haven't done anything. So wish us luck. Okay, so I just wanted to show you all this. As you can see, our stove, the glass on the door just shattered one day and we're not sure what happened. This is a Samson stove and um, the first thing that happened was it cracked here just again out of the blue we don't know like what could have happened that made it crack like that and it wasn't a big deal I mean it was just like okay it still was working um, it would we would have issues with it like when we would um, or if something would spill on it, it would steam up. And I'm sure somewhere down the line that can't be safe. But with this, um, we're not sure how it actually cracked. Now you can see still some of the glass there, it was dark. And then it has this glass on the inside, which um, I've used it since and uh, it was fine. I mean, it still works fine and everything. But just aesthetically, it looks ugly. And we didn't really care. We were just like, whatever. It's not a big deal to us. We were gonna take the rest of the glass on the outside out and just, you know, try to find a glass to replace the stove. But um, actually, when we were out shopping, we found a stove at Best Buy and Again, we didn't want to spend a lot of money. We don't cook that much, but we did want something if we could find something. Otherwise, like I said, if it stayed like that, my husband and I, we didn't really, it was not a big deal. But we found a really good deal on a stove at Best Buy. We ended up paying, I believe a little over $400. Uh, it was a, what they call, unboxed item and so we went ahead and purchased it it was actually 569 but they ended up giving us 20 percent off so it's always good to ask y'all just ask for an additional de discount especially with stuff like that that i'm sure they're trying to get rid of and move out so you know it's good to always ask what well, can i get it for a lesser price or is there any discounts I can apply so yeah we ended up getting that stove for a little over four hundred dollars with tax and everything so um, I'll let you guys know the exact amount but we're about to move this baby out of here so that's what's happening today okay so here's the new stove and it's kind of the same style that we had before the glass top but this one is a whirlpool so we're hoping we'll have better luck with it and like i said it's an unboxed item that was returned so we're hoping that nothing was wrong with it it wasn't completely unpackaged when we got it so it makes me think that maybe it just didn't fit where somebody wanted it and they just returned it but we'll see okay so it is a whirlpool 
But this is what I mean by they didn't completely unravel it. Cause see the, the film, the protective film is still there. And down here on the bottom and on the inside, everything is still in there. It doesn't look like it had been used. So I don't know, hopefully all is well and we'll have a new functioning stove that doesn't look like it's been through the ringer. Boy, that other stove it was just like cracked everywhere. A good time for the grandbaby. <laughs> I have a ton of it, so he'll love that. I'm gonna save it for him when he comes over. Okay, so here's the details. It was 1,079, they took off 180. They took off 360 for the open item discount and then they took out off an additional 108. So that left a total of 431.99 and then with tax we ended up paying 466.55. Good deal. Okay, so here is the new stove. Definitely looks a whole lot better. Um the Controls are up here now, so that's going to be a little adjustment, but it worked out good. So I guess that's one of our Christmas presents to ourselves is a new stove. So I'm so thankful that we found this one at the price that we did. And so I didn't vlog at any of the stores because it was a madhouse. I mean, it was like every store we went to, it was just craziness and so I didn't vlog but I did do a lot of shopping and I did do a lot of um finding good bargains and stuff like that so um I will share that with you all in the coming week but uh today I just want to relax and get ready for tomorrow back to work so wow the weekends go by so quickly it's amazing to me how quickly the weekend goes by it's like it's friday and then next thing you know here it is sunday so anyway y'all have an awesome blessed rest of the day and i will see you tomorrow bye